is perhaps the greatest and the most challenging adventure. No ceremony can create your marriage. Only you can do that. Through love and patience, through dedication and perseverance, through talking and listening, helping, supporting, and believing in each other, through tenderness and laughter, through learning to forgive and learning to appreciate your differences. And by learning to make the most important things matter and to let go of the rest. God's word is very, very clear that the only way a marriage can thrive is through a mutual commitment of unconditional love towards one another. There's nothing like your love to get me through the day. Nothing like your touch to get me carried away. Babe, I know the road's been long, but let us ride here. And I know your faith's been strong, stronger than any. to be kind and learn to disregard the bad if the good outweighs it daily. Let's make a gift of silence, the days hushing into dark, and when we hold each other, let's always be astonished we are where we want to be. Let's hope to age together, but if we can't, let's promise now to remember how we shone when we were at our best, when we were most ourselves. I wrote this one for you. It's called My Eyes Always On You. I gaze upon you and I think, future we will share, all memories we will make, my eyes always on you. I hate to even stop to blink, missing the moment like air, from the moment that I wake, my eyes always on you. You truly are my missing link, not another could compare, gaze that will never break, my eyes always on you. family and friends and loved ones, we are gathered here today to celebrate the love between Sarah and Matthew and to support the commitment they are about to make to one another here before us today. The bride and groom, they would like to thank each of you for being here today for this special, special moment. I've done many a marriage as a pastor, but not as a father.
as a symbol of my love and of my promise to always learn and grow with you. Matthew, if you'll please take the ring that you have for Sarah, place that on her ring finger and repeat these words after me. Sarah, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and of my promise to always learn and to grow with you. Sarah and Matthew, it is my privilege today to pronounce from this moment forward that you are now husband and wife. Matthew, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to pronounce from this day forward, Mr. and Mrs. Crosby. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome out Mr. and Mrs. Crosby.